gift wrapper? <laughs> Siri, why did you tell me that he wrapped for Puff Daddy? Well, he did last Christmas. Yes, she did. She did. Puff likes lots of bowls in those little plastic Santas. And she oh, yes! <laughs> Wow, legends in that scene. After six seasons, the nanny went off the air, leaving Fran fans wanting more. But there's more in store with talks of a reboot and a new Broadway musical. Plus, Ooh. Fran Drescher is still leading the fight against cancer. She joins us live. Yeah. yeah. Thank you. Thank you so much. We're so happy that you could join us. We're glad that you're back. Let's talk cancer schmancer. You've been transforming healthcare and promoting awareness about cancer for years now. So what is the most important thing you want people to know about cancer prevention? That will save lives. Detox your home. We have a very progressive program and people don't realize that we have a lot of carcinogens and toxins in our home, and that erodes the immune system. When your immune system is compromised, you become vulnerable to a lot of things. Cancer is the end stage of inflammation, and when you're exposed to things like toxins and carcinogens, you're going to start getting inflammation, your immune system is going to be compromised, and you're going to be vulnerable to, to everything from virus to cancer, to autoimmune problems. There's a whole host of things and it behooves us all to start reading labels, go organic, go eco-friendly, make our choices each and every day when we go shopping at the market and replace unhealthy things with healthy things. Because how you live equals how you feel and there's really no wiggle room in between that. You, we really have to clean up our acts and use our purchasing power to dictate more responsible manufacturing trends Ooh. because what you buy becomes your vote and what you don't buy becomes your protest. You got to you got to start running for something friend. Good lord, that was well <laughs> said. First of all, I'm a Jewish theater nerd kid so you are like a hero to me. My family watched you all the time. Big fan, just want to say. All right, I want you to uh, tell us thank about you. thank you, my love. Tell us about your latest cancer <laughs> fundraiser. It's the nanny. It's friend Rush right now. Okay. It's a Mahjong tournament, sorry, fangirling, but how did you get into the game Mahjong? I have a girlfriend who was pushing for me to learn the game for a very long time. And finally I said, okay, we're gonna get a group of besties together at my house and we're gonna start playing. So uh, we partnered up two on each side so we could be more people learning at once. And I was partnered with Rosie O'Donnell, who's a dear friend of wow. mine. And we won, and <laughs> someone took a video of us, and that went viral. And so we were approached by a global organization no called Modern Mahjong, and they said, let's do a worldwide uh, Mahjong tournament uh, in support of Cancer Schmanza. So <laughs> we're delighted to do that, and all of your viewers can go to cancerschmanza.org and sign up oh, that's and awesome. learn everything. You can play it virtually online or you can get your own group together and play it at home. And uh, you and, and we'll be raising money so that we can keep presenting the kinds of programs and educational videos that help empower people, transform them from being patients into medical consumers, mm. and just learn how to pivot your life towards healthness and a bolstered and 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 strong immune system. Mahjong, my uh, word, go ahead. I love it. she's figured out to, to mix entertainment with getting the word out. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And speaking of getting the word out, you were on Celebrity Family Feud, playing for Cancer Smancher, and we have a clip. <laughs> Woo! Tell me something you'd hate to have happen while you're making love in a car. <laughs> Friend. Uh, get rear-ended. Get rear-ended. <laughs> 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 now, did that just come out? Were you trying to make us laugh, or did that just come out of you? Well, I, you know, I, I said it, and then I realized this is funny. <laughs> <laughs> she realizes. Oh, I love it. Friend, I want to pay, pay you. That a was a lot of fun, and it was 
a nice way to raise money for cancer Spencer too. You know, it's been difficult for nonprofits through the pandemic because we weren't able to do most of our uh, in-person fundraisers. So all these little ways really help us out. Smart. So, Frank, I wanted to pay you a compliment. You look absolutely beautiful. Yes. Last time we talked, I didn't get a chance to talk to you about that, but I just wanted to put that, tell you that from, because maybe back in the day I had a little crush and... Oh! oh. Maybe, maybe I still do. Maybe I still Schroeder. do. Right, but let's get to the... <laughs> the <nanny>. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get to the nanny reboot are that the fans are very much interested in. Yes. Cardi B might be taking on that role. Have you spoke to her about being in this reboot? Uh, you know, that's something that I said I thought would be a good way to go. She has often compared her style with mine mm -hmm. and done kind of a split side by side photo on her IG account. And I think she's wildly talented, very funny, and she has a funny voice. So one of the ideas that I had had that we've been bantering about when we're ready to move forward is possibly doing a updated version of it, bringing it into the uh, you know 21st century and, and including a lot more people of color. Um, and, but we're not working on that right now because we're still working on the Broadway musical. Yes. And, uh, you know, hopefully that'll be a big hit. She wears so many hats. And you mentioned her running for something. She's the SAG after president. I'm saying Hello. she should run. I know. But she should be president of the United States, is okay. what I'm saying. That Very can come good. next, Fran. That <laughs> can come next. Yeah. <laughs> Fran Drescher, thank you so well, much. You know, this is how Ronald Reagan started. <laughs> Amen, sister. There we go. Thank you for joining us. DBL Nation, you can donate to Cancer Schmancer by texting the word Fran to 443 one or, or of course visit cancerschmancer.org. We appreciate you. We'll be right back. Bye, Bye Fran. Fran. Good to see Thank you. you.